my name is Lumumba Onakoi. Since 1996, the war and aftermath has caused more than 8 million deaths in the Congo, making Congo war the deadliest conflict worldwide since uh, the World War II. Other 2 million were displaced from their home sought asylum in the, neighbor, in the neighboring countries. We Congolese from the Democratic Republic of Congo, living in Phoenix, Arizona, has come before the whole world to give the true and very far uh, version about the situation in the Great Lakes region. We are here to advocate and durable and uh, sustainable peace in the Great Lakes region. It is important for the whole world to know as a country, the DRC is among the most peaceful country in the world when it comes oh, well, well, to hospitality and generosity and humanitarian. In fact, taught its history, the DRC has a track record of welcoming all people in need as refugees, such as people from Angola, Sudan, Rwanda, Burundi, Uganda, and many more countries. It is so painful to see that the very people we helped yesterday as refugee who benefited our legendary hospitality and the generosity and humanitarian spirits are now turning against us seeking the balkanization of our country and making alliance with some foreigner multinational powers to take away our land and systematically root our natural resources such as coltan, gold and cobalt and many more others and massacre our population, rape our mothers, sisters and daughters Remember the Makobola massacre, Mutarule, Kivovo, Kakungwe, Tingitingi, even if I can remember, there is also Kamwena Sampo. Using sexual violence to enforce control over illicit economy activity, including exploitation of our natural resources were responsible for most cases. Their leaders such as Bosco Tangado, Loran Kunda, and others should in the 21st century, a country in the whole world be suffering because of its hospitality to those seeking refuge, or because its generosity and humanitarian spirit to those in need. No, it is wrong. And this is not, this is will not continue. And we are here to tell the whole world that we are more than devoted to take our destiny in our own hands. For the sake of peace, this act should, should be condemned. And the case of the truth needs to be known by the whole world that those who are accusing us today are among those who benefited and continue to benefit from our acts of kindness and are along with their allies after our land and our natural resources. For more than a decade, we have been known as a country of legendary hospitality, unconditional and generosity. That's right. And considered humanitarian spirit, and we will always live up to those values. No matter what, however, together, we all believe in seeking peace as a key to problem in the Great Lake region. In the spirit of discouraging those promoting the war in the region, as well as their allies, we are 
the people from the Democratic Republic of Congo community of Arizona are requesting the following. Number one, the United Nations and the international community to put more pressure on all those governments involving in a situation in the Great Lake uh, region for a durable, sustainable peace, as well as respect of borders and protecting innocent population. Number two, the United Nations and the whole world to condemn any idea of balkanization of the Democratic Republic of Congo, especially in the Eastern region. Number three, the DRC government to secure all the Congolese living in the country, especially those in the Eastern region, and well as its border and putting together structure that will allow Im immigrants and refugees to legally occur the Congolese citizenship. Number four, the world to denounce and condemn the rooting of our resources, coltan and gold, cobalt, <coughs> and many more in the eastern region by encouraging contracts to be made between the DRC government and those multinational